Assalamu alaikum. This is Ms. Takina, and welcome to our first and second grade virtual curriculum night. So my teaching philosophy includes student-centered lessons where students complete hands-on activities. Um, the lessons cater to multiple intelligences and interests to promote higher level thinking in a safe learning environment. Students at the same time learn how to be well-informed and responsible citizens in this class. Social Emotional Learning, or SEL, is a class where students learn how to understand and manage emotions. Students learn how to make responsible decisions, feel empathy, and show empathy for others, and establish positive relationships. This class shows a strong relationship to Islam as it teaches students to become responsible Muslim citizens. Examples of topics covered through SEL for first and second grade class. So the curriculum for SEL is um, based on the second step curriculum. And examples of topics that will be covered in this class are being respectful, being assertive, and handling making mistakes. These types of topics are essential for students to learn at a young age so that they can practice and act upon these lessons when they get older as adults and, um, be, and to be successful in their future careers, inshallah. For math, um, we are um, introducing numeracy routines or also known as counting circles. They are like a math warm up. There are purposefully structured activities to develop procedural fluency, strengthen reasoning and problem solving skills. And these warm-ups do not usually tie into the math lesson of the day. For math assessments, we are be, uh, uh, giving students a beginning of the year inventory test to see where the students are at right now and to further meet their learning needs in the future, inshallah, in this math class. We do give pre-assessments uh, before each unit and a summative assessment at the end of each math unit to uh, learn more about what students have understood uh, over the unit and um, to further um, provide support or challenge them if, uh, based on their needs. And activities the students complete on Seesaw, Splash Turn, uh, worksheets and projects are also ways for um, us to as assess student learning. And uh, also the math curriculum is aligned to the math common core state standards. So for the first and second grade, the math curriculum topics overall include operations and algebraic thinking, number and operations in base 10, measurement and data and geometry. So the uh, topics do advance a little bit more for the second grade class. Um, and this is where the differentiated lessons come in, where assessments and assignments will be based on the student levels. And for the remote learning, we might have days where we have um, the first graders log off a little bit earlier than second grade students so that the second graders can get more one-on-one -on -one time for the advanced topics. Uh, the literacy curriculum is also aligned to the Common Core State Standards, and the reading and writing instruction goes hand in hand. For example, if students are learning um, literature in the reading class, they will be practicing their energy writing skills in the writing class. Um, the combined lessons for the first and second grade uh, are um, uh, used with guided instruction and assessments. Um, the first and second grade reading curriculum includes foundational skills, reading literature, reading informational texts, and poetry. And at the same time, students are practicing their speaking and listening skills when it comes to presentation and collaboration and presenting, presenting their knowledge and ideas. The first and second grade writing curriculum includes narrative, informational, and opinion writing. Um, in the language area, students are practicing their conventions of standard English and increasing their voc vocabulary acquisition and use. The social studies curriculum is uh, related uh, with the literacy skills. The students practice their reading and writing skills um, to um, express themselves and learn more on social studies topics. The curriculum topics include culture, geography, economics and financial literacy, civics, history, and inquiry skills, where students practice creating questions and evaluating sources. The science curriculum overall includes life science, physical science, simple machines, states of matter, movements of earth and sun, and science and spirituality. So science is a very uh, good class for um, us to allow students to make connections with science and Islam, to allow students to understand the world around them and to build a stronger, help them to help students build a stronger relationship with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Um, thank you so much for watching this curriculum video. If you have any questions, please contact me, inshallah. Jazakallah khairan, assalamu alaikum.